Good morning, guys. We are on our way to Toronto. 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 We are spending the weekend there. I've talked about this a little bit in my uh, Sephora haul, but it was at the end, so I don't know if many of you stuck around for that because I got a bit rambly. But we are headed up for the weekend, and I'm going to meet Essie Button tomorrow. And I'm really excited and kind of nervous, but it should be fun. Aslan's not going to be there. Yeah, so. Aslan and Reggie are still back, <laughs> so shucks. But we're going on a little weekend getaway, fun times, woo. Okay, let's go. change to kilometers and I don't know why I'm just like it's over a hundred and I can't hold this very well and it's 63 miles per hour but it's a hundred and one so we just made it to the bed and breakfast we are staying kind of on like the east side of Toronto in just like a regular house like in the like um I don't know how to describe it. They're like the rows of houses, like the streets within the town. And I kind of like it. I like this, like we're not in a hotel. It's more of an authentic feel. And we're just taking a break, getting the internet because we we obviously don't have phones that work. So we're using WhatsApp to like communicate with people. And I think we're gonna go get something to eat because I'm hungry. And then we have our show tonight. We're going to this like dinner theater. So this is the square that we're gonna meet um, at Say tomorrow. And they're doing like this uh, little event. Turban up, that's what it says. It looks pretty cool. Uh, yeah. It's like a cultural event. Yeah. Right. So we just got a quick snack from this place called Patty's. It's a tiny little place. Well, Asian guy. I want to know what you think of it. So I got the chicken and curry. It's supposed to be spicy. It's like a meat pocket. Oh my gosh. Is it good? If I was drunk, it would be my jam. <laughs> oh, really good. All right, so she got the beef non spicy. I didn't actually get any meat. I just got the crust. Give a little bite. It's all right. <laughs> I think it's great, and it's I love cool. the I love the marketing. They got the the logo. It's cute. So after a bit of walking and deciding that. Mine are delicious. I loved it. I like it. Like, it's good, but it's just gotten spicy, and it's just in the non-spicy version, so I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I've been lied to. No, they're great. That'd be a great shop to open, because you can, like, eat there. It's good to walk around food, and if you're not really hungry, like, alternative to, like, a pizza. Oh, so, so. To a pizza? so, we're headed back. That's a terrible angle. You're, like, I'm, down I'm here. yourself. Look down. Um, so, we're going to walk back to our place, get ready for the show tonight. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Let's do this. We are on our way to the show. Woo! Well, dinner and then a show. It's at the famous people players. Yep, famous people players. I'll show you as much as I can, but obviously I can't film the performance. Show. But it's I a black light theater. So everything's like colorful and you can't see the actor tape people see or see right coming. now. So I will just, okay, bye. So we just got here and we are a bit early. The doors don't open until six. So we're just hanging out on our car. <laughs> You're probably in the shop the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> this ham. Hey. I'm so, excited. It's not smells really like a lady. <laughs> They had Garnier in the shower, so I was like, hmm, this is nicer than what I got. He came out smelling like flowers. You mean fantastic. <laughs> Continue what you were saying. Anyways, so we pulled up, and like it's like in an industrial park, and uh... There's so, like seagulls. Yeah, there's like seagulls over there, and like it's not where I thought it would be. Like I thought it'd be like this big downtown show, because it's like, on TripAdvisor, it's like number one, number two thing to see. It's like the one number one attraction, and it's right after like this really famous restaurant. So, I thought it'd be like in, you know. Yeah, we had to drive like 10 minutes out of the city. Yeah. And but I'm excited. Yeah, no, it's cool. Like, it definitely, like, if you can show them, like, the it's like they have, like, the big sign and the With arrow. The arrow yeah. But driving down here, I felt like I was, like, Are we going to go to the Wapale and meet Hank? 
We have to keep the map on. Look up. I was completely wrong. The outside may not be fancy. The inside is so cute. That's not. So there's the theater, it's blackout, and everyone's coming in real quick. So the show was really, really cool. Um, I mean, we kind of explained a little bit about it. So the meals are all cooked by mentally, um, they're, uh, or developmentally developmental. challenged people. Um, and then they go from serving you and and, and uh, the food, which the food was actually really good. Yeah, we had a steak and yeah. a salad. And the salad dessert. was good. The dessert was really good. And so what you do is you eat first and you have a salad, and then after you uh, you match the towel, There's you match the bed. You know I coordinate. <laughs> um, but first you have that, and then the next thing you do is you go see the show, and it's really cool because like the owner comes out and tells you about how it's the 40th year anniversary and they've been doing it forever. Um, or for 40 years. <laughs> for 40 years, that's not forever. Forever. Oh. Okay. Um. Anyway, so. <laughs> Uh, she comes out, talks about it, and then they do the show, and it was amazing. I'll include a link below to the video on YouTube that was like an interview kind of thing that shows yeah. you what it's like, because you obviously couldn't film during the show, but um, I will show you guys what it's like with a link. Um, yeah, it's Blacklight Theater, so you don't see the people, they just make everything move, they have all these puppets, and they just, basically the, the gist of the show is they would have a song and then set a scene and have something sing it or have a like mini story you would watch and it was the most creative thing I've seen fun. in a long it was a really time. Good time like it was really cool so and then you after you have a uh, coffee tea and uh, dessert and then leave and it was great yeah uh, it was a couple like three or four hours we were there we started yeah. at well three hours and started at six and then left at nine so if you're in time. Toronto, do it. It's, it's it's about ten minutes west of like the city. The best thing to do here so far. It was, like, really, hands it was down. a really fun time. It's an experience you won't get anywhere else. So alright, I think we're gonna head to bed <laughs> and try and wake up early tomorrow yep. to go exploring rather than enjoy the nightlife. So <laughs> we'll see you guys later. Good morning guys. Today is the day that I meet Este and that rhymed. Not on purpose. Um, another exciting thing that's happening today is I'm going to meet up with uh, Tori from Pretty Lovely Girls, the blog. I'll link it below so you can check it out. But we've been talking for a couple of months now and just getting to know each other and becoming friends and sharing our love of blogging and stuff. But she actually lives in the Toronto area, so I'm going to have lunch with her today. And I'm really excited. Like, tons of cool, exciting stuff is happening. And it's just... It's crazy to think that a year ago I wouldn't even like be here or meeting her or meeting Essay or being like that into the beauty community that I came to Toronto, you know? So I'm really excited. I just finished my makeup. I'm going to be posting a blog post Monday, probably when you see this vlog, so I'm going to put this up on Monday, hopefully. I'm going to post what I brought in my makeup bag for this trip, and it does this, this space. And uh, I think that's it. I'm gonna get some breakfast and see where the day takes us. So we are out and about, just walking around. We have a, about an hour before we're meeting up with Tori for lunch. Hey. That's what we're doing. It's a kind of a cold day. It's cloudy, but it's not raining. I thought it was supposed to rain this weekend, but it's actually not raining at all, which is super Home nice. Home London. Yeah. It's like, I'm just gonna be gloomy, but not actually rain, so we appreciate it. So we are walking to meet up with Tori, and I see her, and I see that we're walking towards her, but she hasn't seen us yet, so I'm like really excited. <laughs> and then there's you. She's right there. 
zooming in on her. Like a creeper. So we are here at lunch and I met up with Tori. <laughs> I'm really excited because the food looks really good. And we're talking about our meetup with Essa and Alex is making funny faces like he usually does. And we're both really excited. But I'm starving, so I'm gonna eat. Alright. I just wait. I was just like, I'm doing it. No, you can't show them because I'm gonna do a post. I might make a video so they can't see. Surprise, surprise. Sorry. Look at everything in the bag. Ah. You're the worst. <laughs> <laughs> so we're waiting for Essay to get here and there's a bunch of people, which is really exciting. And I'm trying not to be like awkward and antisocial, so I like move closer, but I'm still like <laughs> Hey guys, and I'm excited. I think I'm mostly excited. I think to see her video. Obviously, you see Estee, but like to watch her video and see like what she did coming to here, or if she like vlogs while she's walking here or something. I don't know. I'm kind of excited. <laughs> Trying to be cool. <laughs> hey. Yeah. And I'm just like, I'm a dude. Just a couple of guys. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, no one else bought their boyfriends. Oh, There's I'm wrong. One. There's one. There's one. There's <laughs> one. You hang out. Group. Of course, he could just be here for a friend, so this could be awkward. We're hoping it doesn't rain. Yeah. So we're standing in the colony, but I don't but. know. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm excited for her. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the mob. Look at them. Look at them. Ah! 114 year olds for that photo. I was like, hey, we're friends. I'm gonna help you out. Do you want to carry your bags? I didn't ask that, but I was going to. I was like, shoot, I think I'm gonna take them or something. Yeah. I'm like having heart palpitations. It was nice meeting you. You too. <laughs> so I may have grabbed the camera and made them hug again, whatever. Nobody was really <laughs> whatever. Yeah, no, it was right. fun. Bye. Bye. So we kind of forgot to vlog, but this is the bed and breakfast we stayed at. And apparently it's my vlogging day. Uh, so that was no, a, I was in it. It's all me. Psh, too busy. Pish posh. So that was the bed and breakfast we were staying at, and it's uh, it was actually really nice. There are two, the two people own it. They've been here for 20 years, and they just bought it. And so uh, they're renovating it, and like they put new floors upstairs. The bathrooms are new. They redid the bathroom. I said that twice. Uh, the kitchen's redone. They're redoing the outside. They're like, if you came in like two months, everything would be finished. And I was like, okay, well, you know. So it was kind of cool. It was nice, though. I like the yeah. fact that it wasn't just like a chain hotel. Yeah. Like we get to experience this, this part of Toronto. Which is really cute. Like it's a really cute town like even though the buildings are all touching each other they still have like their distinct flavor so and it's really it was like 10 minutes away from like where the meetup was yeah and it was one of the most affordable places too kayla cam kayla cam getting back to the car again kayla cam kayla cam just met essie button look I out that can't have me let me have a moment she never let me have a moment so we just got home and I am exhausted so I'm gonna say goodnight as always thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you later Bye.